Do you ever wonder about the impact of Megan's fashion choices on the public? Well, let's transport ourselves to the moment the Sussexes arrived in the picturesque town of Whistler. The crisp winter air was pierced by the excitement of royal presence, and Prince Harry's adventurous spirit was on full display as he tried out the skeleton bobsled. But the real showstopper was Duchess Meghan's outfit. She sported a luxurious Hermes quilted jacket, priced at a cool 3,000 pounds. This wasn't just outerwear, it was a statement piece. A marriage of high-end fashion and practical winter wear. Its elegance was undeniable and its style was distinctively Megan. This wasn't just a jacket, ladies and gentlemen. It was a testament to her independence and taste in fashion, undeterred by the ever critical eye of the British media. This distinct fashion choice set the tone for their visit, instantly becoming the talk of the town. Megan's ensemble was a seamless blend of high fashion and practicality. Her choice of attire for the Whistler event was a luxurious 3,000 pounds Hermes quilted jacket, a statement piece that married opulence with functionality. The jacket was a showstopper, instantly sparking conversations and turning heads. But what sets Meghan's style apart is her knack for pairing such high-end fashion with more accessible, practical pieces. Let's delve deeper into the ensemble Megan complemented the Hermes jacket with jeans from La Ligne. The French brand is known for its classic, timeless designs, and the jeans were a perfect fit for the occasion, offering both comfort and steel. They added a casual, laid-back touch to the otherwise high-fashion ensemble, reflecting Megan's ability to strike a balance between luxury and everyday wear. The Duchess further grounded her outfit with comic boots. Known for their durability and warmth. These boots were a practical choice for the Whistler climate, proving that Megan doesn't compromise on comfort for the sake of style. They blended seamlessly with the rest of her outfit, enhancing the overall chic yet practical vibe. To top it off, she donned a cashmere beanie from Aritzia. The beanie, a nod to the Canadian brand, added a touch of coziness and warmth to her winter ensemble. It was a subtle, yet effective way of showcasing her personal style, further cementing her status as a fashion icon. Now, let's talk jewelry. Megan accessorized her outfit with pieces from Burks, one of her favorite brands. The jewelry pieces added a touch of elegance and sophistication to her look, tying the whole ensemble together. They subtly reflected her rich auntie vibe, adding a dash of regality to her outfit. In this ensemble, Megan exuded a healthy and glowing appearance. Her attire was a testament to her unique sense of style, her ability to combine high fashion with practicality. Despite the ever watchful and often critical eye of the British media, Megan carries herself with grace and confidence. Megan's fashion choices underline her independence and unique taste, unfazed by the critical eye of the British media. Her style continues to evolve, reflecting her personality and her journey as a modern royal. Beyond their personal lives, the Sussexes continue to wield considerable influence. It's a fascination that extends beyond the glitz and glam of royal life reaching into their day-to-day -day activities and personal choices. The public interest in their lives, both personally and professionally, is a testament to this enduring influence. When the Sussexes were spotted in Whistler, their presence was not a quiet affair. A camera crew was in tow, capturing the couple's every move. This sparked a flurry of speculation. Was Netflix involved? Could this be the making of a new season of Heart of Invictus or the Harry and Meghan docuseries? Such conjecture is not without basis. After all, the Sussexes have previously partnered with Netflix, 
bringing their unique perspective and personal stories to a global audience. It's a partnership that has allowed them to maintain a public platform despite stepping back from royal duties. However, in this case, the speculation was off the mark. The footage was not destined for Netflix, but rather for a Good Morning America broadcast. The feature was to include an interview with Prince Harry, giving viewers a glimpse into the couple's life away from the royal spotlight. Yet, even as the Sussexes carve out their own path, the public's fascination with them remains. Meghan's fashion choices in particular command attention. Her ensemble in Whistler, from the luxurious Hermes jacket to the practical Kamik boots, was a topic of widespread discussion. It was a perfect blend of high-end fashion and practical winter wear, a testament to Meghan's distinct sense of style. This interest in Meghan's attire is not merely about fashion, it is an insight into her persona, a reflection of her independence and taste. It sends a message of resilience, of maintaining individuality in the face of criticism. It's a statement that she will not be defined by the expectations of others, but by her own standards. Despite their departure from royal duties, the Sussexes remain firmly in the public eye, with Meghan's fashion choices playing a crucial role. In the end, the Sussexes' influence and the public interest in their lives are a testament to their enduring relevance in the modern era. Meghan's fashion influence is more than just a statement. It's a reflection of her persona and the evolving nature of royal fashion. Duchess Meghan, with her keen eye for fashion, has shown us that royal style is not just about tiaras and ball gowns. It's a medium to convey one's persona, a way to make a statement without uttering a word. When we look at Meghan's ensemble during the Whistler visit, we see a woman who knows her style, cherishes her individuality, and is not afraid to break the traditional royal mold. Her Hermes quilted jacket, a blend of luxury and functionality, was not just a piece of clothing. It was a representation of her persona. Strong, independent, and unafraid to embrace the unconventional. The jacket, paired with jeans from Laline, comic boots, and a cashmere beanie from Aritzia, was a masterclass in how to combine high-end fashion with practical winter wear. And let's not forget the subtle sparkle added by her selection of jewelry from Burks, one of her favorite brands. Each piece was a reflection of her taste, her love for comfort and luxury, and her ability to make any outfit look effortlessly chic. But Meghan's influence on royal fashion goes beyond her personal style. She's part of a new wave of royals who are redefining what it means to dress like a royal in the modern era. Gone are the days when royal fashion was all about sticking to traditions and playing it safe. Today, it's about expressing one's individuality, embracing change, and being a trendsetter. And Meghan, with her distinct sense of style, is leading the way. This evolution of royal fashion, led by Meghan and other modern royals, is not just about changing the way royals dress, it's about changing perceptions, breaking stereotypes, and setting new trends. It's a testament to the power of fashion as a medium of self-expression and a reflection of the changing times we live in. As we've seen, Duchess Meghan's fashion choices are more than just about style. They're a statement of her independence, persona, and the changing face of royal fashion.